How many Versace pieces do you have? Every single bag of Versace, every single shoe. So what'd you get? First. First? How much was it? Four thousand. Four thousand. Alright, my bad. What's the most money you ever spent on one piece? One zero 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 zero. Ten thousand? My parents pay me everything. I spent eleven thousand dollars on a Dior jacket. Eleven K? I know it's horrible, oh but oh my god. Today we're in the heart of New York City, Manhattan, and we're gonna be going up to luxury store buyers, all the way from Gucci, Louis Vuitton, Rolex, and we're gonna be trying to see what they do for a living, how much money they make, and how you and I can get rich just like them. Let's go. We see you walk into Rolex, so what do you do for a living? I'm in a construction business. Do you own your own construction company? Yes. What's like the range someone can make doing what you do? Half a million. Half a million. Do you think des buying designer brands like Rolex or like Louis Vuitton, do you think that's worth the money? Uh, if you like it, I don't know. What's the most expensive thing you've ever bought? I don't even remember. <laughs> don't even remember? You don't even know? Yeah. Like 10K, 5K? Or more. More? Yeah. You just see you come out of Louis V store. So what'd you buy? I bought a canvas bag. How much is it? 3500 Damn, 3.5. So what do you do for a living? I'm a piano teacher. So how much can you make doing, I guess, being a piano teacher? Play me annually or monthly? Yeah, monthly. 8K. 8K? And what's the most money you've spent on like a designer item? Was this the most? It be the most. 3.5K? Yeah. Yep. Okay, stop, stop <laughs> repeating the price. Stop she's like, she's like regretting it. <laughs> I'm a surgical assistant. It starts off probably at 50 and can go into 175. I was a surgical technologist and then went back for a surgical assistant. So how long did you go to school for it? One year. One year, that's it? So what'd you get, if you don't mind me asking? First. <laughs> First? How much was it? 4,000. 4,000? Oh my god. So do you think buying designer brands are worth the money? I don't know. It's a one-time deal for me. I write books. I have a publisher and they give me money in advance. What's the most amount of money you ever made from like one book? I sold the movies for two and a half million dollars. It was never made in a movie, but I was very rich at that time. What did you buy from Ralph Lauren? Uh, Ralph Lauren? I buy a lot of things. I know him. You know, you know Ralph Lauren? Yeah. He's a wonderful man. I know his wife, his children. I buy some jackets and ties. How much do you usually spend on them? Two hundred dollars, three, four, five hundred dollars. I work in real estate. You can make a lot of money in real estate. Two hundred to five hundred thousand, up to a million. I don't know. So go to six figures. Easy. So if I wanted to get into your position to do what you would yeah. do, what's some advice you would give to me? Finish school, go to school, always be determined, don't take no for an answer. So what'd you buy? I bought a bag, a cool bag for the fall. Okay, so how much was it? 7000 Damn, 7000 I was going to ask you, what's, what's like the most amount of money you ever spent on like a designer brand, but is this it? No. <laughs> <laughs> More? 16 What do you guys do for a living? Oh, uh, fashion student. Yeah, me too. So how do you guys buy this stuff? Like, where, where do you get the money? Like, do you guys work or? Parents' money. Parents, okay. So what did you guys buy? I got a swimsuit and a ring. So how much was it? How much was the bathing suit and the ring? 600. 600 for everything? Yeah. You got the this Balenci. What are, what are these? Dior, okay. What's the most money you've ever spent on one piece? Maybe one zero 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 zero. 10,000? Uh, yeah. Like on coat. I think it's from Dior. It's like the fur. Fur coat for 10 grand? Uh, around. What would you buy? You, you bought some from the real real? Uh, mini dress. A dress? Yeah. How much was it? $200. My parents pay me everything. They pay you every day? Yeah. So that's your job? Yeah, that's my job. <laughs> Yo, let me know how a student got more money than me. A lot of these students get that parent money and just be balling out here. We don't got nothing like that. We over here trying to make the money, asking the people how they make the money. Yo, look at this car. This, look, this is who we should be asking right here. Excuse me. Can I ask you what you, okay. Uh, I got the skates. So how much you spend on this? What was these? Fifteen forty-eight. Fifteen hundred. Ooh. Okay. And what do you do? I'm a truck driver. So what's like the salary that someone can make doing that? Uh, hundred ten. Hundred k six figures. Yeah. Don't get my slippers in the video, <laughs> man. <laughs> Why <are> you doing? <laughs> I'm an elevator mechanic. A mechanic? Elevator mechanic. So what's like the salary that you someone can make doing that? Three hundred a year. Three hundred k? My God. So you living the rich life. So what'd you get from Louis V? You yeah, wanna see? see? Yeah, I wanna see. I wanna see. Oh, we got these. We just got someone with the burgundy version. Of so do you think buying designer brands are worth the money? Depends. If you like it, you, you know, it's a buy. You don't need to be rich. I see you got the Chanel bag. So what do you do for a living? Military. Military? Yeah. So what'd you buy from Chanel? It's just a wallet for my girlfriend. It's like around like 3, 4K. 3, 4K? Yes. Damn, that's that military money, right? 4K on a wallet? And you in the army? I'm about to enlist in the draft. I think I need that army money. 
My name is Noor, I own a truck repair shop. It's a family business for over 35 years. So what sets you apart from your competition? Because I'm sure not everybody's running around with one of these. Speed and customer service, I guess. People, they want their trucks up and running as soon as they break down. And if you can offer that, they come back right away. So that's how we beat everybody out. Do you think that buying designer brands are still worth it, even though you're, you're this rich? I do, I'm stupid, <laughs> but I don't recommend it, honestly. So what's the, like, the most amount of money you've ever spent on a piece of designer? Probably 3000 on an outfit, not, not, not like 10000 20000 no, we're not that. Do you think buying designer brands or like luxury brands is worth the money? Sometimes, if you have the money, yes. But not everything is good. I like, I like, I like Versace. Uh -huh. So how many Versace pieces do you have? Like a lot. Every single bag is Versace, every single shoe. What should be like the max that people actually spend on their clothes? Oh, for like maybe a full outfit, $100 I feel like is good. Or is that too much? I don't know. I am a project accountant. So. What's like the salary someone can make from that? 75 to 90. So how'd you get into that? I just kind of took accounting in school and I just kind of went from there. Do you think buying designer brands are worth it? It's an investment. If you buy it just for the trends and just trying to be splashy and all that, I don't know, it's not really worth it. But if you buy it for actual classic pieces, then yeah. What's the most amount of money you ever spent on one piece of clothing? I spent, oh God, I spent $11,000 on a Dior jacket. A shirt. 11K? It's a, I know, it's horrible. Oh but my God. It's, it's, it's a very classic piece, so that's why I bought it. Wait, so this guy spent 11K on a jacket, but he makes 75K. What is that? How do you even take that? Like what, what, what percentage is it? You do 75? No, not time. 11K? No, bro. All right, these guys over here, they look they look smart. They got a suit on. Excuse me? If I made $75,000 a year no, 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 and I no, bought you something, can't, you can't? All right, my bad. If I made 75K and I spent 11K. Wait, what the f was it again? All right, we got it. It was like 15%. So don't take financial advice from that guy or me. So what advice would you give to younger people trying to get some stuff like this, trying to get rich like you? Rich? <laughs> Hell, I ain't rich. You gotta have money to buy Louis V. <laughs> Save your money. Save up and buy what you like. Don't spend your money on garbage. Don't just waste your money on a name. Finish your school. Don't give up. Work hard every day. Just work hard. Work hard. I, yeah, I started my own business like when I was 17. I used to sleep late. I wake up early every day. How many hours per day do you work? I start a job till I finish. I don't mm. stop. Save your money and be able to afford what you buy. Don't use credit cards. Save for the worst days. When there's no work, you'll be out spending. But if you don't have money, spending only when it's good. What are you going to do when it's bad? Are you in a relationship by any chance? Yes, sir. I'm married. How much does being in a relationship impact your success? It helps a lot to have a good woman by your side. I've been a wife for 64 years. So how much has been being in a relationship? How how much has that affected your success? Has it been oh, a positive or oh, very positive? She's the publisher himself, and I attribute much of my success to having her as a supporter, supportive person. It's a very stable relationship. A lot of people say it's a distraction, though. So how does it work for you? I mean, if you have a little girl by your side, that is a distraction. That's not helping you in your dreams or becoming something. You gotta find a woman. You find a woman, the right woman by your side. This was probably one of my favorite videos ever that we ever filmed. Meeting these rich people, meeting these people that buy like $5,000 pieces is kind of crazy. If you guys are trying to get rich like we are, follow us, subscribe on the channel right below to keep up to date when we post these videos. We're gonna be posting a whole bunch of these throughout the whole next year. Comment what city you guys want us to go to next and we'll be there. Peace.